It, they don't even allow us to wear jewelry at work, so why I have my watch on that day, I, I still don't know. As I was loading parts onto the automatic feeder when one got jammed, so I tried to free it by hand so I wouldn't have to call maintenance. Well, as soon as it came loose, the, the gear started up, and, and it got my watch, and just it pulled my whole arm in, and just it chewed it up. It was, it was awful. I was doing maintenance on the feed adjustment. My shirt was untucked, hanging down to my thigh. Somehow my shirt got caught in the feed line. It just started pulling me in. My leg was broken in three different places. The only reason I'm alive today is because someone hit the emergency stop button. My hair should have been pulled back or up in a net, but I was in a hurry and I just didn't take the time to do it. I reached down to pick up a tool and that's when it happened. My hair wrapped around the shaft and I'll never be the same. These people were injured at work. Every job has hazards. Our job out here and your job where you work all have hazards that must be avoided. Today, we want to talk about some of those hazards and how to protect yourself from them. An important part of this protection is controlling long hair and loose clothing around moving machinery, as well as understanding that wearing even simple jewelry while working can cause serious injuries. Come on, let's have a look. Industrial manufacturing food processing, chemical plants, pulp and paper, warehousing, even office areas have special and unique hazards you must be aware of. No matter what type of work you do, you must be aware of these hazards and dress appropriately for your job. What we're after is staying safe and not allowing moving parts and machinery to reach out and grab you. Allowing long hair, loose clothing and jewelry to get tangled in this type of equipment causes many injuries and deaths each year. Just have a look at this. You see all those moving parts? There's one thing about machines, they don't stop. You get your shirt sleeve, your pants.